Hey guys, so I'm back with another video and today I'm going to be showing you how I got this hair. I am loving, loving, loving how it turned out. I did use some products from the Hair Milk Collection from Carol's Daughter again and I wanted to try out another one of those kind of uh, wash and goes using a mousse and I used their curl milk styling mousse um, so I will take you guys through that to show you how I got this hair um, I didn't pick it out too much I'm probably gonna be picking it out throughout the day and just keep because you know it's humid and you know it's gonna always keep shriveling back up and you're gonna have to keep picking it out and it's gonna turn into a situation but I kind of wanted some really big soft just nice airy hair for the summer. I'm sorry guys, I need this, this bang girl. But, so bang. Okay, there we go. I like a little hair in my face, but I don't want to be blinded by it. So I'm going to show you guys how I got this hair. It came out so soft and so pretty. I absolutely love how this turned out. I'm definitely going to be doing this again. Um, but yeah, if you guys want to see what I used and how I got this hair, then definitely stay tuned. Make sure you guys are subscribed to my channel if you end up liking this video and also turn your notifications on so you do not miss an upload. And I will see you guys in my next one. Bye guys. So I'm starting off with freshly washed and deep conditioned hair and I'm just going in and spritzing my hair. I want it to be really, really wet for this wash and go because I wasn't sure how it would turn out if my hair was only damp. So first I'm going to be going in with the Carol's Daughter Styling Butter and this is the hair milk, part of the hair milk collection. I think they rebranded this and it's called like the Curl Defining Butter now. Um, but this is the one that I have. This is the original one that they have. But I did pick up the other one as well to try out to see if it's the same. But I'm pretty sure it's the same similar form uh, formulation. So I'm going on with that. And next I am going to go in with the Hair Milk uh, Curl Enhancing Styling Foam. And I'm just going to apply that all over my hair. Just to rake it through. I'm not gonna shingle. When I use foams, I do not shingle my hair. I just literally apply it, rake it, and I do apply, I don't wanna say a lot of foam, probably about six pumps per section. Um, kind of what I wish I would have broke the back section down a little bit more, but it still turned out nice. And then I'm pretty much just gonna repeat those steps all over my head, and then I will be back once I apply all of the product. Okay, and I'm also just using that Moire Ultimate Growth Spray that I showed in my previous video. I have been using it just to, you know, see if it works or does anything special. So I have been using it um, and I just apply it to my scalp every wash day. And I'm just going to go in again with the styling butter and the mousse. I do detangle with my Tweezerman brush. I love this brush. This brush is bomb, guys. If you don't have it, get your hands on it. It is like one of my favorite hair tools. If you're into hair tools, I know a lot of people do a lot of finger detangling. Sis ain't just got time. I ain't got time for that. So um, I like this brush a lot. Um, I still like my Felicia Leatherwood. I go back and forth between the two. So either one will do. And I actually liked um, in the front section, I kind of did smaller sections. Um, I kind of wish I would have did that in the back to give me more definition in the back, but I tend to prefer most of my definition to be in the front anyway, because that's the part that everybody sees. But nonetheless, it came out good. So I'm just going to finish, and then I will be back. So 
so this is after I applied all the product and I just go in and kind of smooth out that top area um, with some foam as well the one thing I like about not using a gel is that I find that my hair dries so much faster when I don't use a gel so that's nice as far as drying time and then this is my hair after it has completely dried been picked out I absolutely love 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 how the results came out super pretty really divine very 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 soft um, you guys will see me go in here and pick it out just to make it a little bit bigger it is summertime so I keep a pick on hand because the shrinkage gets real in the summertime okay so I just keep a pick on hand and that is the completed look guys I hope you guys enjoyed this video I hope you like this wash and go I completely love 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 how it turned out and I will see you guys in my next one thank you so much for stopping in and checking out my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn your notifications on so you do not miss an upload and I will catch you guys later bye guys